I've been looking at this wall for a really long time. It's really cool that uh, I got to paint it. Thank my lucky stars, I uh, got to rock my dream wall. I'm uh, Elixir Elliot. Uh, I paint Graf in Toronto. Ongoing theme in a lot of my pieces uh, is that uh, the people of the city, they're like giants of the city. So that's why a lot of my uh, characters are really huge and uh, the cities are really small. Because I think uh, it takes the people of the city to build the city back. So a lot of the times characters are tactile, like they're really touching the city, putting it back together and that kind of stuff. So it's kind of what's happening here. As it trails off a little further down, the abstract pieces are sort of uh, explanation of how the city would be in the future. This piece right here is about uh, communication. Uh, I had it as communication in the sense of like the city should uh, communicate about all its issues and have uh, just conversation about it. Just simple as getting in the park and sitting there and talking about anything as, as friends, as, as a community. We have to communicate, you know? Things that are pertinent to the time, like right now, like in the middle, there's uh, all the little kids in the orange hoods. Hopefully just having a conversation about the indigenous people in Toronto, standing by this wall, we could sort of like get into that conversation, get into uh, communicating about it more, you know? I want to say something, I want to help, and I want to like do something that creates change connect the, the wall and the piece to the city. And I paint murals all the time, so I'm really happy that Artworks Toronto, Artworks TO, has um, enabled us, like, nourished us to actually do this kind of work. In the pantheon of all the um, artists in Toronto or, or graph artists in Toronto, I'm happy to be there, you know? I still want to contribute to different ideas and the city has a lot of potential. So if you see me around painting something, don't question it because this is the year of public art. So it's, it has to be something about public art, right?